Laos is literally a small country, a least developed country in terms of high technology and modern trade facilities, but its potential for organic produce, wood products and handicrafts is considerable. It is expecting that these Lao products shall be competitive at the Chinese Trade Expo in October. This was the observation of the vice governor of Guangdong province, Yang Xiao Tang, at the Laos Roadshow for the 2015 Guangdong 21st Century Maritime Silk Road International Expo to be held from October 29th to 31st. He said, it is obvious that Laos has no exit to the sea and so is a so-called landlocked country. But the participation of Laos will enable it to raise its profile and get involved in business cooperation with its foreign partners. The event is designed to promote the trade, economic and tourism cooperation among the countries of the region as well as to exhibit the typical quality products of each country. In addition, it also aims to accelerate new forms of foreign trade and support the creative development of cross-border electronic commerce, trade and shipping logistics. Following the Fruitful Initiative Exposition of 2014, the authorities of Guangdong are keen to attract more exhibitors and enterprises from domestic business units and international firms. Mayor of Vingjan, Dr. Sin Lavong Kut Pai Tun, President of the Lao National Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Mr. Si Savat Tilavong, and Chinese Ambassador to Laos, Guan Hua Bing, were also present at the event.